All right, guys, a very short video to get you jump right into Cubism 3.0. This is all I'm going to do today. So there is the Cubism website. You probably have seen this. There is the Euclid website, and there's something called the Live 2D Creative Studio. Now, not to get confused, but Live 2D Creative Studio is not a software. It's not a program. It's basically a um, business to business service where the official, where the official um, tech supports and their artists help you to develop your project whether it is in training your artists and animators or they can do it for you depending on what kind of plans do you want um, it's a new thing so I guess you know worth worth mentioning but uh, if your project has a pretty good budget and you want to go all out in the quality then you can talk to them they can even do online online training with your uh, animator or something like that. So you know how, you don't have to be in Tokyo. All right, so um, so look into it if you got something serious. Otherwise, uh, if you're just looking for Cubism and Euclid, here they are. So the Cubism website, and let's start with this one, uh, tells you what something is new. The new new stuff, I'll tell, talk about that later, but uh, I wanna get you through the first part, which is purchasing and installation. All right, so you scroll down all the way down, you will find a link to download, and there is also a purchase page. If you have the 2.1 license, here is where you want to start with. Well, you start with the, the email, right? Um, go to the email, read through them line by line, and then uh, what you be told to do is that you want to go to this purchase page. Now there are three separate uh, items. One of them is Cubism 3.0, the other is Euclid 1, and then there is the pack, be um, you know, the Cubism and Euclid combo, all right? And since they're subscription based, uh, depending on how you choose, the pricing is different. And if you have chosen, if you have a 2.1 license and you have chosen to um, your, your, your package, Go ahead and assign user or purchase. Move on a few pages, follow the steps, step by step, and you get to a point where you first have to put in your credit card. They're not gonna charge you. But put in your credit card and then move on to the next page where it's the final confirmation. That is where you have a, a spot where you can put in the coupon code. Put it in and it will tell you the updated price, whether it's completely free or it is a discount or what is the final price, what the final price is, all right? So go ahead and follow this, those steps and you'll get there. Now, if you want to use 2.1, it is still available. You just go to the download page and you can still find Cubism Editor old version, which is basically 2.1, they're still available. Uh, why you would do that? Because if you have a current project that is not ready to get an upgrade to 3.0 or, um, most of them won't be it won't be ready because we don't have the SDK is out like the 3.0 SDK is out so if you're using Unity stuff you you probably would have no problem moving on but uh, if you rely on something like uh, a viewer ID viewer it is currently not un uh, th there's no version that is compatible with 3.0 yet so uh, yeah so multiple reasons that you might want to stick with 2.14 a little bit longer. I think face rig updated, I think. Or they announced they're gonna update. I don't know yet. I'm, I've not been following face rig for a little bit. Um, so yeah, we got the download page here. And you, if you want, if you're looking for a model to test in Euclid, there is this page. This is the Euclid manual page and you will find down there sample models, Fuka and Yukun. Uh, I can show some footage of it uh, but I don't know much, so there isn't really much to talk about in Euclid yet. Uh, I guess you can watch the, the trailer video, basically it tells you most of it. And if you, anywhere in this video that you don't understand or you got a quick question you want to ask immediately, you want immediate answers, uh, here's a Discord icon, I think I'll put it down here, alright? And just click on it, you'll get to the Discord channel that I opened. Uh, some of us are usually online and we can give you quick answers. If you got trouble installing or you got uh, some pre-installed questions, uh, maybe you could answer, maybe we could answer, or if it gets really technical, like you got some major error in uh, installing the software, then you have to talk to the tech support in the official forums. Um, 
One thing, if you cannot open 3.0, you may not know where to find the log file. The log file is actually in C drive, app data, roaming, live duty, cubism editor, and there should be a log text file or log inside the log folder. And these are the stuff with all the codes that would help the tech support uh, to figure out what's wrong. Also, do let them know your computer spec, what graphic card you have, what uh, CPU you have, Windows or, o or, or, or uh, Mac, and uh, one more thing, RAM, all right? Because I think Cubism and Euclid are very RAM demanding. So if you don't have enough RAM and it does detect that, maybe it doesn't let you start up. I don't know yet. Um, but yeah, uh, if you get really technical, uh, you got to ask the tech support and give them the law, give them the specs. That is all for now. And for next episode, I will talk about the user interface.